and I am back with another episode of the Fisherman Fishing Planet and yes we have actually unlocked two lakes over the course of being at uh, France the La Cruz River we op opened up uh, Quanchkin Lake Louisiana and we opened up uh, Moose Lake up in Alberta Canada so I wanted to come back through here and test a few things honestly because According to the Lockaba, he said that uh, he's been having a lot of trouble catching fish here when normally they should be easy to get. At least they were in um, Fishing Planet Classic. So I'm going to try a few of my spots here to see if I can't get some of these guys. And I think I'm going to go ahead and start with my catfish spot over here. Usually I find it at Pelican Lake. Now I'm a little bit hampered with my inventory. Unfortunately, I don't have uh, the money, well, the level to get the three foot crankbait, but I, I will in one more level. I'm almost there. Level 27, I'll have it. But I'm not so sure they're going to bite off of these. I might give them a try, but 12 foot ain't going to work. This water is not deep enough. So we're going to come on and head in here. Let's get rid of that so it's not in our way. I always get kind of turned around here. All right, what we need to do, we need to look for the front of the little cabin here, the Pelican Hut, and make a left. Now you can probably see the markers. Those I've marked, there's a hole there, a catfish hole. And if you got the timing right in Fishing Planet Classic, you can get uniques right out of here, both. Uh, channel cat unique and uh, flathead but it is not exactly the best time of day right now so I'm gonna go ahead and get time forwarded let me see here what is let me look show you on the map real quick first as you can see there's the hole now the hole is kind of kind of long so you can kind of cast in front of it and around it if you watch your depth, you'll know when you've hit it properly. It should be eight feet or more. If it's less than that, you've missed it. There's another one over here that we might check later on. But let's go ahead, because I've caught more here than anywhere else. Now, we're going to fast forward time to probably 7 p.m. All right. Now, if you look at our little thing, we're starting to head into the peak. It's time that the catfish start biting, and then once we get to the nighttime, it's going to be a major peak. So, it only gets better from here. Let me go ahead and get my rod pot set out. And... I'm going to check to see what I have as far as, let's see, I've got these right together, don't I? No? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Okay. Yeah, I only have two rods this time. And like in Fishing Planet Classic, I usually have three. Let's throw this one first. I'm going to throw this one on the first marker. Yeah, see, it's a almost eight feet right there so I'm close to it at least and let's see let's try right here on this one nope nope it's not it it's sometimes hard to hit let me try it again That 
There we go. That's better. Not quite eight feet. It's not right on the mark, but it's pretty close. Now I'm going to try these rotten minnows again, like I did. Now if you're wondering where to get those, that was part of the Halloween event, and I'm trying to get rid of them, honestly. But they actually catch gar and catfish pretty good. Let's see here. Yep, 98 inches. So I am determined to find the deepest part of that hole. a little more to the right. Well, me damn, something was going after it. Well, never mind. Looks like we got a bite. Make sure he has it. He has it. All right. Ah. Well, that was unexpected. It's a nice largemouth bass. Let me try a little bit over here. Maybe I'm too far to the right. No? Well... I wish there was a way to tell. Let's look at the map again. Okay, so it's... This way, maybe? No, God, no. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, it's really... It's easier to find this on Fishing Planet Classic, too. Okay, there it is. And we're getting bite. two bites. Are you kidding me? Don't. No, it wasn't that. He took the bait on. He took the bait on the other on the other line. See, this one. Oh crap! There's a fish on it. <laughs> that was weird. There you go. Nice channel catfish. He didn't so much as move. There we go. Must have been this one. Yep, they took the bait. Let's try. Right here. There we go again. OK, 
Okay, this guy isn't too big. Let's see what he is. Another largemouth bass. We'll keep him. And we got one on here now, too. Okay, this one's a little bit bigger. I only have a Phoenix. I don't have the Brutus yet, so this may be a fight. That's why I'm not attempting to go after the Alligator Gar just yet. I don't think I can... I don't know if I could bring one in with this. What do we got here? A flathead. Nice. Well, it's my first one in this game. 918 cash, not bad. 20 pounds. At least I know my catfish spot is working fine. It's a little harder to hit the mark, though. That's the only thing. But once you do, it's usually pretty good. Let's see here. I'd like to see what it does once the sun goes down. Whoa, how in the hell did I throw it that hard? <laughs> I might bring it up to 90 inches because that is nowhere near, well, maybe not. <laughs> there we go. Another good one. I think it's another flathead, guys. Yep. Eight fourteen. Not quite as big as the last one, but still, not bad. I don't know how I got so many of those rotten minnows. <laughs> Still like 44 of them left. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and try to shorten that just a little. Let's make it 90. That's better. Still pushing it. I'm getting a bite. Look at that first rod. Watch the line. a decent one. Very nice. Very, very nice. He's almost there. There he is. Okay, 19 pounds. Let's see how big he looks when I hold him up. Oh, yeah. It's not bad. It's a nice looking fish. Uh, the bobber behind there is going nuts. So. Well, it was. Oh, he got me snagged. 
He got me snagged. Great. Okay, let's put that where it goes. Here we go on the first one now. Ah, now we're getting one on this one. Hold on. This one I know I've got. Let's see here. Oh boy. I think we might have us a trophy here. Whoa. Yep, I think we got us either a very large common or a trophy. Whew. Yeah, he's a big one. I love when they break the water. <laughs> oh, that other one's going nuts, too. He is not coming. Damn, I almost had him in there just a second ago. Ah, lost the other one. It happens. Oh, wow. This might be a unique. Yeah, I love when they just suddenly let go like that. Damn, he's so close now. Come on, you bugger. Almost there. There he is, guys. Yep, trophy. Holy crap. 2230. Cash. 43 pounds. That is a nice fish. I'm not sure if this gear would catch a unique. I'm not so sure it would. If I did, it would take a long time to bring him in. Yeah, I gotta take a look at this guy. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, that's not even the unique, guys. Whoa. That is a fish. Jeez. 
That is what I'm talking about. Big old fish. Uh, Dua, you can catch him here. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's just the bass are giving you troubles. But I'm not having any trouble with the cats. Not one on iota. I'm pretty much pleased for right now because, I mean, a trophy that size... He had to be close to a unique in size, though, because that was a big fish. They do like the rotten minnows, I'll tell you. I'm not having any trouble getting bites off of this. Okay. No, we don't. I'm thinking Channel Cat. good spot straight up and down that's right in the hole right there that's perfect yeah I know I have my bobber very large that's because I'm blind <laughs> and I'm old There we go. Yeah, he was mouthing it for a minute there. Yeah, I think we have us another flathead. Probably regular size, but still. There we go. We got him. He might be regular size, but he's a big common size. Look at that. 29 pounds. 1340 cash. Ah, very, very nice. Very nice. I am filling up my net. <laughs> catfish master. Got a certain number of catfish. I am pleased by that. The hole's right there. Right there. He's perfect. No, no, are you kidding me? Seriously? Yeah, once it's snagged, it's shot. You gotta recast. Now, on this one, my Phoenix, I'm using a 5 odd hook. The other two, I'm using a 4 odd. Anything over 2 2 out or over is probably best, but you're going to get bigger ones, the bigger hooks. But right now, 5 odds as big as I can get. There he goes. He wasn't all that certain about that, was he? Let's see if we can't put a little more pressure on him here yeah you can see what I'm talking about I am literally bringing them in one right after another and it only gets better at night Another big flathead. Mm. 31 pounds, 14.22. Well, 
night is coming guys and I might have to make this into a two episode because we've got to do the fishing at night too that's all there is to it and it's gonna go in way too long for a video just by one video anyway yep it's night time all right let's pull it in anyway guys I hope you enjoyed that episode please be sure to share comment like and subscribe and I will be back with another episode of the fisherman fishing planet so until then as I always say aim straight cast far and have fun and I will see you later bye bye